I'm going to pass this along. This just came in. It's a, a coastal flood advisory for lower Fairfield County right up against the shoreline. It's not too much of a big deal. The winds are out of the northeast today and some of the water is going to get pushed into Long Island Sound. There might be. So I just wanted to pass it along. Keep your eyes on things. If you live in a normally flood prone area of Fairfield County, you might see a, uh, tides about a foot above average. We did have an excessive amount of rain yesterday. Boy, it came down with three inches of water in parts of the state. Westbrook coming in with three inches. Clinton over two and a half. Norwalk over two and a half. Norwalk over two and a half. Uh, New London, Milford, uh, just about two and a half there as well, as well as Groton, two and a half. Look at the skyline behind you guys. Isn't that spectacular? Absolutely gorgeous. It's going to be a fairly good day today. Today's going to be one of the nicer days of the week, so get out there and enjoy it because uh, the rain is back in the forecast. Not so much tomorrow, not so much Wednesday. I think both days, tomorrow and Wednesday, will be dry days, but we do run the risk for some passing showers, maybe even a little bit of drizzle, kind of unsettled weather, and then Thursday, the heavy rain is back into the forecast for trick-or-treat. Temperatures out there right now, 51, 50, 47. Pick your town, pick your temperature. Here are your headlines, mostly cloudy cloudy to start, but we are seeing some partial sunshine out there right now. You could expect partly to mostly cloudy skies as we move through the day today. It'll be dry and then drizzling clouds tomorrow, drizzling clouds on Wednesday, and then it looks like back to the deluge on Thursday. All right, temperatures across the state in the upper 40s, low 50s. Find your town, find your temperature. 47 in Norwich, Willimantic, 46. These are some pretty good looking numbers. They're about 10 degrees above average, if not a little bit better. This is 15 degrees above average here. 53 in New Haven, 53 in Bridgeport and the winds are out of the north, northeast, anywhere from five to eight miles an hour sustained. As we move you through the day today, mixture of clouds and sunshine, more clouds than sun, but not a bad day all in all, with temperatures topping out in the low 60s. More of the same for the shoreline. Temperatures will top out in the low 60s with a mixture of clouds and sun, a little bit more in the way of clouds than sun, a little bit more in the way of sun than clouds at certain periods of the day. It all depends on where you are and, uh, and how much sun Mother Nature decides to throw in our direction. Rocky Hill, our vantage point towards the skyline of Hartford, starting to brighten up right now. Sun is up at about 718. We can see it coming up over the horizon in stores. Not a bad looking start. And we have mostly cloudy skies in Waterbury right now with pretty dark conditions there. All right, our regional radar dry satellite and radar confirms we do have a, an extensive amount of cloud coverage out there for you this morning. And those clouds will kind of hang tough through the day today. Here's Futurecast. It's tomorrow's weather today showing us an hour by hour depiction of mostly cloudy skies. You can see this is right through midnight tonight. Then areas of drizzle. You see these little pops of green, maybe a passing shower. This is all for the tomorrow's forecast as well. Maybe a passing shower, these little dots of green. It'll repeat again on Wednesday, and then we forge ahead to Thursday morning. Rain, which could be heavy at times. Unfortunately, for Thursday afternoon and Thursday night, it's looking rainy and windy. And a windswept rain Thursday night into Friday morning. It's still raining for us on Friday. And then by 1 o'clock, things start to gradually wind down. And that bodes well for the upcoming weekend. Highs today climb into the low 60s. Limited sunshine. It'll be breezy. And then your seven-day forecast after a fairly comfortable night again with terms of temperatures under mostly cloudy skies. Your seven-day forecast includes 65 tomorrow, 64 Wednesday with mostly cloudy skies and uh, some drizzle, maybe a passing shower, but most of Tuesday and Wednesday will be dry. Thursday and Friday look wet. Ugh. And then Saturday and Sunday look good, but it's going to be considerably cooler and windy over the upcoming first weekend of November.